Hey guys, another nerd news here, ZDNet article. I will put a link in the description below. R versus Python. R is now out of the top 20 programming languages despite a boom in statistical jobs. So uh, the subheading is, is R's usage among developers declining because of Python? I'll give you the short answer. Yes, Sereno. Essentially, I'm summarizing the article here. There's been a boom apparently in data sciences and um, statistical analysis. And you got two languages out there. I'm sure there's others. R and Python that is used to do the data science stuff and the machine learning stuff. But R has basically fallen out of this index. It used to be in the top 20. Now it's fallen into 21st place. Python is going strong. And uh, in interview people at Netflix, and Netflix said, yeah, everybody likes using uh, Python because Python has really powerful libraries. Python is much more of a general purpose language. It's used in all kinds of different things. R is a bit more specialized. So the people who love the R programming language will argue, and perhaps quite rightly, that R is better than Python in certain areas. But as I said, many times in many videos that open technologies, open languages, uh, open technologies that have more flexibility for you, easier to work with, they typically win out even over more performant technologies or languages. So there you go. So that's why when people would ask me, should you learn R or Python? I would comment, learn Python because Python just gives you a whole slew of options. So Apparently, not just in, in this index has R dropped, but in all indexes. When you're looking at these indexes where they rate languages, you have to understand that where you, you, uh, you get this rating can change. You know, some people look at uh, this Tyobi index, and some people look at the Stack Overflow index in terms of how many questions are asked, etc. So you're going to have uh, some variations here. And typically, in the top 10, 15, you're going to have you know, Java, C++, Python, C Sharp, JavaScript, PHP, SQL. These are the usual uh, characters, if you will, the usual languages in, in the top rankings. They'll fluctuate all over the place. In some rankings, for example, PHP is number four or five. Others, like this one's number nine. Uh, in some rankings, JavaScript is number one. In other rankings, in this one, it's number seven. But what you never see in the uh, top 10 is R. Well, you'll also never see Ruby, and you'll never see Swift. And, uh, but if you've been watching my channel for a long time, you know that was going to be the case. So there you go. Link below, R versus Python. R's now out of the top 20 programming languages, despite the boom in statistical jobs and machine learning. Python, the old, more open, flexible technology wins as they typically do.